Now, if I was to say to you, colorism, would you understand what I'm talking about? I'm not talking about coloring in books or anything. Um, it's a subject that's back in the spotlight once again. Uh, Beyonce's father, Matthew Knowles, brought it to our attention, claiming that his daughter and other artists like her are actually more successful because they have lighter skin. Now, colorism itself is defined as prejudice or discrimination against individuals with dark skin tone, typically among people within the same ethnic or racial group. Now, in Western communities, it's thought to be a lasting relic of slavery. Well, now a new film called No Shade uh, aims to tackle the issues surrounding colorism. Listen, can I, can I ask you something, a serious question? Oh my God, yeah, of course. Am I too black? What? Like, am I too dark? What? Who's been talking It's just the, um, the last guy I went on a date with, you know, like, we were talking online, Aww. and we had such great banter, yeah, like, um, he seemed really interested in me. Then we met up, and he, he, like, literally attacked me. What? He said that I tricked him. He's an idiot. He's literally a fool. Well, there you go. Um, with me, I've got the writer and director and co-star of No Shade, Claire Aniam Osigwe, and the lead actor, Kadeem uh, Pierce. Thank you very much, both of you, Thank for coming you. in. Um, colorism. Claire, why on earth did you think that a film had to be made about this first? Because, to me, colorism is the brown elephant in the room. It's something that my peers talk about as professionals in personal settings like the barbershop or the hair salon seem to be coming up very frequently as women are sort of reaching an age where they're starting to think about marriage and settling down and friends and, and actual clients had come to me because I'm a dermatologist as well and said to me Claire I'm struggling to find love because of my shade men are telling me that I'm too dark to be wifey you know I want someone lighter or even white because I'll be deemed more successful and I thought this is so topical it keeps coming around in different facets and it needs to be told. Uh, Kadeem you are the lead actor Danny yes. in this piece how was it playing a role um, you know that so many women of darker skin tone such a difficult subject to talk about isn't it but it has to be spoken about um you know you're the character that hurts how how yes. did it, you know what did you learn from it um well i, I wouldn't say that it was a, it was a newfound experience mm. it's definitely something that i've grown up to be around in my community and i think um i was proud to to be one of the you know the front runners um you know thanks to claire for writing the script um, that we're exposing a lot of these issues and instead of sweeping it under the rug and really, you know, opening up to, so we can have conversation and so we can, you know, uplift and, and really empower women that have suffered these issues in their, their past. So basically, if we lay this on the table, Claire, you're too black and I'm not black enough, mm. isn't it? That's, That's it. basically what it all comes, comes down, down to. These are the conversations that are, are being brought out. Absolutely and particularly pertinent with today's young and social media, sure. why? Why, because we're finding young people using social media to throw shade on each other. That's why the name of the film is a double entendre in the sense of no shade is superior, which is a line that comes out of the film. And there's also no shade as in I'm not throwing, you know, insults. Because on, on social media, teenagers are taken to hashtag team light skin, hashtag team that. dark skin. And you've got young people who are acknowledging each other not on the content of their character mm. and the things that our ancestors have had to struggle and fight for for us to be on an equal playing field against the white man but actually within our own communities now we are pecking each other on you know how, how part, deep isn't our isn't tone it? is that is very very sad okay so what's the message to come away from because I I feel ill sometimes even just bringing up the subject of mm, color mm. I think we should be past it and it just it, it hurts the community itself. What message do you want people to take away from this film? The message in the film is literally that true love conquers all and go with your heart. Between the character of Danny and Jade, there is this true romance and it's a romantic drama. So I don't want people to think it's all doom and gloom. Some hilariously funny moments. It's very frank, it's fresh, it's fun. But it's really about saying, putting the mirror up to us as the black community and say, hey, we can do better. And it all starts with us. If we want to be treated as equal on the world stage, we need to love ourselves first. I've got about 30 seconds. I think a lot of people outside of the black community will wonder, 
is this really even an issue? They'll be shocked. Very quickly, Kadeem, what would you say? It's definitely an issue. Yeah. It's been going on for hundreds of years. It's still relevant and probably even more prominent with social media today. Okay. And this okay. is something we need to unpick. Okay, and No Shade is on general release. Have a look at the website. Have a look at my Twitter feed. You can find a trailer and more information. See you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>